Yo everybody, Sarah Comfer here for you with yet another weekly benchmark video. Wow, is it bright in here. <sighs> it was not supposed to, it was not this bright earlier. Well, it's another day. And there goes most things. Back to the grind. At least the light has acclimated a little bit. However. It seems to be yet another day of just being rather than doing. The same as per usual. If only I didn't squander my free time. Man, this would be such an easier job of life. However, as per my stay and shirt may comply, I have yet to understand the physicalities of living an honest and worthwhile life where I steadily improve rather than just mundanely be. I don't think I've ever really looked at an art guide in like the last three months. So my art has started to stagnate into this constant being of I don't know what the heck's happening but I'm doing it regardless. So I have not been improving and that's been you know a uh, pretty pretty annoying to say the least I it's it's very annoying so annoying that I'm running out of it is what it is that uh, not frankly no there's there's a lot of reasons to say it is what it is I saw a good movie um, last two days ago i saw suzume it was a very good movie highly recommended if any of you want to watch a good movie it felt to me like to say the least a very well done well narrated um movie that you know the the quality reminds me of ghibli really it seemed to me like a modern day ghibli film I keep coming back to that factor and I keep saying, man, why isn't Studio Ghibli a thing anymore? You know what I'm saying? Studio Ghibli made such good movies in the past and yet, you know, they really haven't made anything else recently. I think I heard of uh, Ghibli making like one movie and it was a CG animated movie and it was really bad from what I hear. I didn't watch it myself, so I, I can't really state to say what was going wrong with it or nothing however i will proclaim that the one article i did see about it because it was the first time i've heard about ghibli in like three years was that it was a cg movie first of its kind and it was not that great kind of it was okay but it was like kind of emotionless compared to the you know the original feel the original kind of like um the soul of uh, original Ghibli films. With the way they animate everything so meticulously and uh, really put it all together. Um, on the other hand, I, I had like maybe five hours of sleep today. Pretty good if you ask me. However, my body seems to not agree with that because the last three hours, I don't even know where the time went. I kind of just, I was here one second and then the next second. Three hours have passed, and I'm really, really not sure why. However, it's five o'clock, and if it's five o'clock, and I've done my Kangole and my Japanese lesson already, and my R1 slash 1, that means I'm frankly a put ahead of the bell curve by like a large margin than how I've been recently, so that's good to hear. I'm honestly getting really fucking tired of 
I'm getting really tired of uh, whatever this work schedule is. It, it's been absolutely terrible. I don't know what's happening. And frankly put, frankly put, I'm starting to doubt that I'm even improving as a result of the uh, lackluster drawing methods that I've had. Now where am I to be? I seem to have a backlog. Let me see here how many backlogs I have. Uh, I thought I didn't have much, but I, apparently I do have. However, I've been running low on my backlog recently because I keep building up like a very steady pace of like, you know, two additional drawings that I owe every week. And it's been going on for like a cumulative sum of five weeks. So I have more than like five and a half, like 11 drawings plus five that I missed from some of the days I was supposed to draw. So it's like I'm missing 16 mini sketches. So I think my month the stock hold is down 50% right now. So if I had to count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 22. Yeah, I'm I'm down like actually one third maybe. One uh two three three tenths I would fail. Uh something like that. So it's not as bad as I thought it would be. Oh I will state it is pretty bad. It's about like if you had to round it, like about one third chance. That's not really rounding, but you get what I mean. However, you get what I mean. Uh, it's been tough. It's been tough. Just like my hair. It's been messy. However, I just finished the Limbus Company um, side event. Got the full 6,000 tokens, so I completely cleared out the shop. I did the refraction railway one completely to this end. I cleared all three chapters. I'm about to finish the battle pass. So once I'm done with all of that, I think I can finally rest easy in Limbus Company and just maybe play it more casually on the side for the story instead of going all out and saying bang, 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 bang. I gotta do the best that I can. Because honestly, frankly put, it's taken a lot of time away from me. Just like whenever I play Mahjong or otherwise, so instead of Mahjong recently, it's been Limbus Company. And it's been like that for the last three weeks, and I, I don't really know why, so... Now that I'm finally done with that, and I've gotten all the mod markers, I, and I can finally say that I, I've done the game to basically full completion, I can finally play it more casually on the side, rather than just... You know, endlessly play it day in, day out whenever I have the free time. Like uh, the last three days, I've been non stop farming that chicken part side event. And honestly, I gotta tell you, it, it's not fun. It's not fun at all. That guy has a ramping damage modifier. And if you do so much damage too soon without aiming at any of the little chickens, it, it goes in, it, it says too much, too soon, like in the inscription. It's crazy. And it starts gaining protection stacks. In order to get rid of the protection stacks, you gotta kill the mini ones, but like by that time, he's already ramped so much damage up that he just like straight up wins most coin flips. It's insane. Like, why give a guy stacking damage over time as the de as the as the battle goes on? It, it reminds me of that one part in the refraction railway where I have to fight this guy and he fucking has poison. And he stacks poison, so there's no like, there's no like, you, you can take 20 turns on this run. No, it's it's more like, you have like, 11 to 12 turns, and if you don't clear before that point, he's gonna kill your entire team due to poison stacking. And it's crazy. It's so damned crazy. I'm not gonna lie. However, uh, 
The only thing I regret is that I was unable to finish Refaction Railway before the deadline for, you know, the uh, third tier e -peen. I only was able to clear it maybe two days later after the deadline, so it was on me. However, it is what it is. There's no going back. And I'm definitely not going to renew myself and say, oh, dude, I'm going to definitely get it next Refaction Railway. Screw that. Refaction Railway is way too much. I'll do what I can with what I have. I'm not going to become an EP player like I did in Epic 7. That was not my intention when I started Limbus Company. So I don't know why I'm acting like it. So, yeah, I'm just going to play casually. In the first place, Limbus Company is very casual friendly with the way they keep giving, like, a... Uh, lunacy and everything else so I, I i'm feeling pretty comfy with the way i'm playing limbus company right now it's a pretty good game it is what it is One second, I just realized I didn't have my Twitter open. The world. So like I said last week, we restarted the streak. I had a separate drawing was very awful because I had no time. That's besides the point. I'll, I'll make it up to her someday. That's why I keep drawing. Um, my was pretty good. Got two likes. Fracture relapse. I don't know. I went for something simple. Same with monologue poison. Went for something simple. I tried a more involved kind of drawing this time around with tangent meeting. I felt like it went about okay. About okay. Forgot him in between a pretty easy, um, pretty easy drawing. I had to put one of the hands behind the back because I was running out of time. Felt like a good compromise to me. Uh, chase deadline. I tried something new with the inverse like uh, coloring. Uh, it turned out pretty decently, if you ask me. There's no real like lines like the lines of white in between the the color and the fine line like there usually is as a result. However, I don't know if I want to keep using that kind of style. Kind of looks weird. Maybe it's because it is a completely black and white character. Eh, whatever. This week, this month's recap, I used the drawing that I really liked from Lucky Star. However, it got like only one like. It's fine. It's fine. The drawings that I did. Finished the Kankole event. All of it hard mode. Finally done. Felt great. And being done with Limbus coming in too feels great too. However, back to the grindstone with Kenkole. Soon as I finish, gotta get back to doing those dailies. Not like I wasn't doing the dailies during the event, I was doing it the entire time. Ha ha ha. Self acclaimed subsisting is that kind of feeling where, like, I have no time to actually concept the fing fingers. So even though I tried hard, it, it just doesn't come out right. I've been feeling that a lot recently with my drawings. Like, honestly, this. This one I didn't even want to draw. I sketched him out a while ago, and I was like, there's no way I should ever sketch, fully render this sketch. This is like, now that I look back on it, it's kind of weird his nose, but however, you know, I only have like two people that actually look at my art. So I said, you know what? I'm going to watch Susan May today. I need to get out early. I got to do something. I'll do you. So I did, and you know, I, I'm pretty happy that I was able to make it to Susan May somewhat on time. I think I missed like the first minute. However, I got I got the gist of what the first minute was. So, you know, it, it's good. I tried making up for it by because I was invigorated by Susan May by drawing a more uh, by drawing a Funamuse design for the first time in a while. I don't like his designs are always so her designs Funamuse's designs are always so contrived there's a lot of you know like this checker pattern this checkered pattern uh the multi-layered bandage the blood and then the the, the multi-striped hair it's really really just a lot to, 
don't even get me started on these boots. I had no time to concept these boots, so they looked kind of really bad. However, you know, I tried. Uh, that's what I'm trying to do today. I'm trying to try, which is why today's today's video is at 5:26 instead of the usual seven o'clock. Like I'm molding, like it used that 5:26, like it used to be. Oh man, ain't that a dream? To be back to the old schedule where I went to time, went to work actually on time. However, I don't even think going to time, work on time, all the time, really like gives me much benefit. However, it is what it is. Gotta keep going. I'll keep trying. It is what it is, after all. <sighs> so yeah, that's been about my week. I tried drawing yesterday. I really did with Burnt Briskly. I ran out of time almost, however. I did make it 11.58, barely, barely made it. And I questioned myself why I even bother. <sighs> it's been like that recently. However, Suzume has given me a little bit of pep in my steps, so hopefully, you know, hopefully I keep up this momentum where I actually seem to be on a Strictly speaking, better time schedule than I normally am. However, speaking that I did sleep only like five hours instead of the eight that I should. I don't know if this is going to continue. Let's be clear. Anyhow, that's all I got for you. Um, it's a gradual process, I'm sure. Maybe someday I'll look back at this and say, man, I did really improve. Right now, it doesn't seem like that, however. Like, compared to 100 days ago, there's a lot of market improvement. It's all about trying, after all. It's all about trying. It is what it is, after all. Anyhow, this has been Zerocomfort here for you with yet another weekly... This has been Zerocomfort here for you with yet another weekly benchmark video. Um, remember to like, comment, and subscribe, all that jazz, if you want to, of course. And until next time or something, I'll see you all later. Thanks so much for watching.